That's a that's a, uh, okay. a bad journalism. Do you guys joke. remember a song? Yeah. Do you remember a song? I do. Happy <laughs> <birthday>. <laughs> No, Jeff, don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> I remember loads of songs. Yeah. Do you are, are you thinking of one in particular? Yes. Okay. It is. It is. It is from the 1970s. Don't get it's by a guy named. I think his name is. Uh, wait. I'm gonna look it up Car. real quick because I want. Because the the worst thing I could do Car. is. Car. His name is Car. I'm so tired. Oh yeah. Yeah. I was in Las Vegas for a day and a half, and that really takes it out of you. Right. Oh my God! In okay, water. Oh, I forgot this play. We don't, we don't really get like the four Gs out here. Okay, here it is. Okay. Do, you want, do you want to plug into the thing? It's it's by, it's by a guy. No, I, well, I don't want to. I don't want to make Kevin Day freak out about copyright. Like I don't want to play a play a song. Kevin, I, Day, Kevin Day's been dead for days. Um, it's by a guy. It's it's a 1970 song. It's by a guy named Clarence Carter. Uh, it's called it's called Stroken. Yeah. <laughs> well. Oh yeah. Dave, that was Klein, a Dave Klein has lost his goddamn song. mind in the front row. <laughs> Dave oh, Stroken. Yeah, Stroken's fucking weird, man. It was I a start, Columbia. Okay, well, here's the thing. Swim so, team so, so, song. Dave Klein, listen. would you please keep your fucking act together? It was a Columbia. I've never, I've never seen somebody. I was, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm dating that. a, I'm dating a young lady, uh, 12 years younger than me. There's a lot. She's a Valley girl. There's a lot of things that she does. Like, 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 I, I, I can't tell if she. So every, every Christmas. Her name is Jordan Peterson. We watch every Christmas. <laughs> Right. Uh, every Christmas we've tried. We, I think we we figured out yesterday that we do this every Christmas, but we never remember because we're drunk. We try to watch all the Die Hard movies, and, uh, wow. and, and and I think every it's a Groundhog Day. Like I'm always like, you've never seen Die Hard? No. Like, well, you got to see the sequel. It's really uncomfortable. And I was like, okay, let's watch all of them. Okay, the third one gets kind of amazing because it's so intensely racially aware. Um, and 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 the, uh, and, uh, uh, and, and and then we always. Have, but then we started noticing because it's like it comes up and it says resume playing and it's right at the end we're like we've done this before we've watched all the diehards we always fall asleep well, before uh, yeah. uh, the first uh, Simon says booby trap in the fountain remember, remember when you and me and Schraub and Chris Tomlin tried to watch all the Hellraisers and we fucking just gave God up damn there's seven of them there's almost <laughs> seven diehards now for real yeah there's like Five. There might. Is there six? I, there, I know. There's what you're raising your. Oh, you're, you're you're holding up the number five. I thought you were like like. Can I come up? Because there's eleven, and yeah. I got a degree <laughs> in Die Hard at Columbia. <laughs> um, anyways, so the song's called Smoke. The reason I thought we were listening to true crime podcasts. So there were these a couple months. All the true crime podcasts like all said the same thing a couple months ago. Um, when, re, there was this family. They, uh, they, they, uh, a 17 year old girl escaped from the family. She called 911, uh, and, and the cop showed up and she said, my, my siblings have been imprisoned for fucking 20 years in our house. It was like, you might remember that. It was like this news item about this, this family that kept all 13 of their kids like chained to their beds for right. like, uh, forever. And some of them were in their 20s because you can't have the, the, the like, uh, that many kids without some of them being in their twenties. Uh, like, like it takes like up to nine months to make each one. And uh, you have so, to lie fallow once every three years. Uh, so, so, so like they, they just had like they, so, so they had full grown adults who were like malnourished and, and and anyways the families the last name is the Turpins and and we're like holy shit what's up with these Turpins and then I just started you know we're feeding the dogs and we're just kind of high and I'm like I've been Turpin. Uh, <laughs> And Cody's laughing, and I'm like doing this song. I've been turpin. Oh yeah, you know I've been turpin. Uh, and, and she's like, "What is that song?" And I'm like, "I think it's like, what is it? I've been smoking. I'm smoking. What is that song?" And I was like, "Is it? I believe in miracles. What is no, it? It's no. really called." You've been, you've been I'm looking stroking. For it. And this, then I find it. It's called Stroking. This song is I was fucking. Like, what is this song? Stroking. I, I agree. Before you even play it, this song is fucking strange. It is so fucking weird for the weirdest reasons because the What's guy it, is, is, is it about fucking or sucking or stroking or I, I don't know. That's part of the twist. Is it is that? <laughs> so I don't think I don't think I'm allowed to play it. I don't think I play, play it. Who gives a fuck? Uh, is stro stroking gonna sue us? Well, we could always delete it later. Well, I could talk, if I assume like if I say like how about this like I mean I play it like like what is it? 
It costs like thirty five grand to like buy like a Sarah Bareilles song. But we can delete it at any time if we want to. Like, we could just I, I, not put it on we, the internet. We can delete it tomorrow before it drops. It's and fine to play it as a live performance in this room. Right. Oh. That I know. So, so right, 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 right. But, but if if you don't want it to exist forever, we want we might have to drop it and just right talk that's about fair. it. Yeah, I, I I do think it's valuable to just. I like, think it's important. But we could bleep it and tell them go online and listen to it online. Well, I typed because these folks they they can't do that. That would be rude to the show. Yeah, we're, got a lot of like. Uh, Younger people in the audience that you know they're like they have no frame Stroke of reference. Stroke to the know, left. Oh, he, here it is. It's he like stroked to the right at one point. Yeah, he's uh, stroking. Is there something that I'll be doing tonight? Like, the, yeah, it, it goes into stroking. Um, is that something that are we doing tonight? Is that what he yeah, said? More or less. He, I know he strokes it to the left. I'm pretty well, sure he, stro- he strokes it to the right. How could you because not? Because I'm a. Li- I'm a Libra, so you got to stroke it to the left and stroke it to the right because I'm All about. Right. I'm about the, balance. The, the, the signal's really weak in here. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna bail on the planet. Play planet. the fucking yeah. song. No, right. I'm gonna I'm just just said the opposite. Right. So if I'm you take the opposite point of view, then be, what you're doing is you're just putting the brakes. I. The, no, knowing it isn't. I'm not. <laughs> hey, I know it too. God, if only someone knew the. I have the lyrics written down. I don't need someone to know them. Uh. It, 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 okay, so so he 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 says. Well, this is great. We don't have to edit anything, right? And yeah. they'll Google it anyway. So he says he the, he he are, he's the protagonist ostensibly, right? Yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. I mean, well, yeah. It's it's not about Dracula. It's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he he says I. It's the first person. Okay, I don't, right, like, sorry, like, yeah. he, he, he never he, says in the song. By the way, I've been Dracula this whole time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, and quite frankly, actually, toward the end, he, kind in a very smart does. branding move, he has a woman cry out his name many, many... Oh, okay, it started playing, so whatever. All right. Oh, wait, sorry, hold on, sorry. If you've ever made love just before breakfast. That was... That's part way into the song, so... Here we go. When I start making love... Okay, so so I want to stop it there. Yeah, when when I start making love, I don't just make love. I I be stroking. Right. So now I, I'm going to ask the question later. What does he think we're going to think he means? And what could he possibly mean if he doesn't mean? And I have I am I am the last person to uh, shame him for this because I literally be stroking during making love in a variety of ways. Like I'm very like happy to involve uh, self pleasure in a, in a weird intersectionality with fucking like uh, se- uh, sex is uh, is is a is a journey, not a destination. Right. <laughs> It's a, you fucking hang out with somebody. Right. It's a it's a thing you do for a while, so and when you, it stops, it stops. And whoever's stroking is stroking. You have been. <laughs> you you have been stroking in, in in your own in your own whatever. Life. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's like like my therapist said to me at one point. She's like, you know, you're gonna be in a relationship one day where you're gonna feel like masturbating while you're playing a video game, and your girlfriend's gonna be in the same building, and you're gonna think. I'm gonna go find her and 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 make it her problem <laughs> as a, as a as a as a as a path of least resistance. I, I was getting and my- I was like, that's not true. That's not how monogamy ends up working. Like, come on, we tug one out while they're in the shower, and we because we don't want to like have conversations about blah blah blah. And it's like, no, that's all about shame and all this stuff. It was like, sure enough, it was like, God damn, I'm horny. I, knowing that I, I there's no shame in me being able to just fucking start stroking. Um, uh, and and Co- Cody can either be fine with that, or I, 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 like like it's not about getting caught doing it, trying not to wake them up. But it's just like like God, dick's hard, stroke, Wait. stroke, stroke, and then like and like like because she'll she'll do it too. It's like like we'll be watching Superman too, and she'll be like, ha, ha. and I'll be like, what? Did you fart? And she goes, no, I came. Um, I'm like, you just masturbated? And she's like, yeah, I'm the fucking master. And I'm like, this bitch is amazing and I'm off the hook forever. Like, that is what you need is a partner. Su- During Superman 2, Dick Donner got fired off that movie and she still came. 
So she be stroking, you be so stroking. So anyways, I'm not judging the guy. I'm just saying, like, the guy, that's he, what he's yeah, leading with. He, he, I'm just he, saying, like... I, I think we've already, in, in the first three, like, lyrics, we've crossed a threshold into his world. Right, and, where and it's already weird. Like, he's, he's presenting it as weird. He goes, when I'm making love, I'm not just making love. I'm also stroking. And I'm like, okay. Uh, he, maybe, maybe he has, uh, like, uh, oxygen loss to his brain. Tell, tell, tell me more, Clarence Carter. I stroke it to the east, and I stroke it to the west, and I stroke it to the woman that I love the best. I've been stroking. That's cool. He's stroking it to her. This is um, your rap mentor. Let me ask you something. Okay, now, he, now let me ask you something. What time of the day do you like to make love? Have you ever made love just before breakfast? Have you ever made love while you watch the late, late show? Okay, this list start better start getting way more fucking adventurous. <laughs> Because so far, you're literally listing the most common times for lovemaking. But guess what? He's just going to run down a list of the laziest ways to make love. But he's he's chesting up on the listener. Uh, There's a couple more items, and he gets increasingly defiant, like, what about this? And every time, it gets more more common. I just wanted to... Have you ever made love during a lunar eclipse? <laughs> Have you ever made love at Lover's Lane? Uh, well, let me ask you this. Have you ever made love on a couch? Well, let me ask you this. Have you ever made love on the back seat of a car? Okay, it's in, not on. Uh, uh, are, you, are you the Munsters? On the back seat? Uh, do you drive an Excalibur? <laughs> are, you, are, you, are, you, are you on a plow? This, this, this record's called Bucket List. <laughs> a bucket List for, for, for De Niro's character in Awakenings. Like, like, like too, oh, too, too soon too for... Soon. Okay. Have you ever made too love soon. catching a tennis ball with your right hand? <laughs> Have you ever made love when you were 17 and it was uncontrollable? Have ha, has dry humping ever led to making love? But 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 is he leading to something grander? Dan? Uh no, he's leading to a segue. That's and I'm like okay. like what how did this song become a weird Neurotypical Be- challenge because, <laughs> right. like, because hey, people well, be have you ever made love when you're drunk? What does he imagine? <laughs> What does he imagine is the other side of that? Are they saying, well, no, that's very cool. Please continue. I think he imagined, or, I, he or must like, be only talking to his parents who are like, it's a four poster bed or you're going to hell. Or, or are they like saying, yeah, I have. And he's like, well, what about in the back seat of a car? And he's like, yeah, I have. And they're like, well, what about on the moon? Well, you know? I think he's, I think that's what it is. I think he's, he's cause he's about to tell a story about, about the back seat. It's like a segue. Well, it just seems like very much like bragging. And so I think far. he didn't want to leap into, No, he, t- he takes it to the bridge. He's like, like I'm going to walk you into my world where, Hey, look, there's different ways. Sometimes be- you're in the backseat of a car. This yeah. story takes place in the backseat of a car because police are about to be involved. And I don't want you to picture them coming into my bedroom and uh, so, yes, I was in the back seat of a car. And in case you're going to be thrown by that, a police car. No, he wasn't in a police. Sorry, car. sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just saying. I'm, I'm, no, I'm, I'm, fine. I'm just thinking like, oh, he's just setting. He's 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 inviting us into yeah. into like, have you? Hey, hey, he's he's like being like Kinsey. You know, he's going like, hey, how fucking straight are you, man? When it comes to locations and times where you're making love, you make love all over the place, don't you? Including the back seat of the car. Yeah. He, okay. He's so saying, fade in saying, on me. He, he's saying, are you freaky? But he's he's saying, look, I'm not I'm not even that freaky. I make love sometimes before breakfast. I make sometimes during the late late show. Right. Sometimes on a couch. Sometimes in the back of a car. I'm kind of walking you into my world. Right. Where I am a regular person. Right. Where, so okay. Yeah. So so and, and I'd be stroking on you, regular things. When right. you f- when you find stroking. out the payoff, you're going to be like, well, why did why was that plank necessary? Why couldn't you just jump into a pool this shallow? Because that, that it's called. It's called verse, verse, chorus, bridge, 
where they take it to another place and they walk you into a, across the threshold. But I will note this song is breaking all the rules right away because the only other song that does this to my glee is uh, Eric Clapton's "It's in the Way That You Use It." Like you notice, he just it just starts like boom, ba -ba -da 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 -da. hey, make a lot. I've been stroking. I don't, you know, like like he he doesn't even like. There's no verse. It's not like uh, you know I'm gonna tell you about the wild thing for a while and then wild thing. It's like he kind of like gets into it. Take Anyways, us, okay, here take we go. us to the bridge. Take us to the bridge. <laughs> All right, here we go. If I can, uh, Mazio, uh, take us to the bridge. I remember one time I made love on the back seat of a car. Sure. And the police came and shined his light on me, and I said, "I'm stroking." Okay. Okay. So I just want to speak on behalf of the police there in that situation and say, still the same charges apply, sir. <laughs> I don't know if you're if you're speaking in terms of legal jurisprudence, but our job is to put your dick back in your pants because your car is a place well, where police can see it. But when he goes to court, I guarantee you his defense is going to be uh, define what stroking is, and that's the twist that's coming, and it's coming it's coming unintentionally. Uh, because, and I don't know if it's intentional. I don't think it's intentional because there's another twist in the song that is intentional. Um, the one that's unintentional is that he finally will use stroking with a, as a verb with a subject. I don't know if it's the correct term, right. object or subject, but that there's a that he'll he'll say what he's stroking. Uh oh. And and I'm like, oh, you should lead with that or not be confused about the ambiguous response. Yeah, to because this. Chuck Berry would open with whatever he was stroking. He, right. He, he so was, that then he can play the game of like, yeah. I've got a little bell yeah. and I call it a dingling. Now let's play fucking salted salted nuts or whatever the SNL sketch is. Not comedically sophisticated, that sketch. Oh, he's back for an eighth time. Mmm, salty balls. What the fuck? This is like a 1950s joke. Okay. So um, just to me, that line that we just heard changes changes the meaning of the past lines because he's saying all this stuff and it sounds braggartly. But now he's telling this story. And so it recontextualizes the early lines such that it sounds like he's saying he's trying to come up with a way to relate to you. He's like... Oh, you ever have sex on a on a on a couch? No, no. Uh, well, what about in the back seat of the car? Okay, okay. Well, I was having sex on the back seat of the car. Yeah. And a guy came up, and so so remember how I said earlier that I was stroking? Well, that was just like this one time while I was having sex in the back of the car, and this guy comes up to me and he says, "What are you doing?" I've been I've been stroking, you know. And but now I he's just about noticed, to continue to explain this to us. Yeah, it's also notable though that I don't think the cop said, "What are you doing?" I think he just shines the light and he goes, "I'm stroking." Guilty conscious, <laughs> guilty conscious. Uh, yeah, can, can you go back and play that previous line? Okay. Because right. I think it's important that we go back and recontextualize. Because this guy is endeavoring to explain something serious. Right. By the way, ouch. I'm not sure my dick has an east and a west. Okay. Let me ask you something. How long has it been since you made love? Huh? It's important to find out. Did you make love to explain this next part? <laughs> I don't remember this part. He needs to get a baseline. Are you making love tomorrow? Did it's important for this next part I'm about to explain. Uh, or maybe it might be that you planning on making love. Uh oh. Right. But just remember when you start making love, you make it hard, long, soft, short, and be stroking. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. That seemed like a stall beat. <laughs> Wait, that was just like... He said make it hard, long, soft, and short? Yeah. Make, make it paradoxical is his point. Like, sex should be fucking challenging. Yeah. Make, make, make it the... Uh... But here comes the thing that I consider a twist. It's going to be really subtle, and I'll have to, like, so... Okay. Now, when I start making love to my woman, I don't stop until I know she's sexy. 
Next time. And I can always tell when she gets satisfied. Because when she gets satisfied, she starts calling my name. She said, Clans Carter, Clans Carter, Clans Carter, Clans Carter. Clans Carter. That's smart branding. The other night, I was stroking my woman. Okay. The other night I was stroking my woman. Okay, so now he's stroking. so he was never talking about his cock. Yeah, he's talking about the, he's the, talking about being sensual. So it, now it makes sense that the cops come up and shine the light, and he goes, "I'm fucking stroking, man. I have a civil right to do so." It's a stroke. Like, yeah, he's I'm fucking about, touching someone's skin in a way that and to the no, east no, the you know, he's talking about putting. It's, it's he's talking about the stroke of the in and out of the dick. And he the just thing. said stroking my woman. Or oh, you're saying you could use that and like, a, and it becomes kind of like that's oh, stroking where, my woman, like means putting penetrating her. I think I, I think he's talking about fucking. Well, and I would say also in 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 contrast to my theory there, where I was like, oh wait, he's the joke's on me for for thinking he was talking about stroking his penis. But he what he in his refrain he says, I stroke it to the woman that I like best, which mean which means not. It means you, you, what are you what are you what are you stroking when you're stroking to something? You can't be stroking a piano to. Yeah, it's not uh, a ver- it's not a it's not an intransitive verb. <laughs> uh, so all right, well, so I but I thought that was the twist, but his twist is just profane. And it got so good to her. You know what she told me? Let me tell you what she told me. She said. Okay, well, damn. Uh, Is the, that the, a problem she was anticipating? The the, the defense rests. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I I I, I mean, the case closed. If it's not, he's talking about fucking. He's talking about fucking a pussy, and then he goes, "Oh, also, if that, if if the, her stuff is too tight, if it's too tight, I'm how gonna, is your ass looser?" But then, <laughs> what kind of woman are you bringing home with you, Clarence Carter? But then, but if my then, vagina's too tight, there's always my ass. But then, he, he chooses that moment to get demure and not say the word ass. I know. Well, because he's, that's the one thing that I'm saying. I'm thinking like, well, you yeah. know what she said to me? Like, I, the, the, he just sings the rest of it and then he finishes the song. But like, he might be thinking like, you know what? And then I stopped dating her because I'm not, I'm not doing that. Well, I be, I be stroking. I mean, like a neck rub. Like I'm like, I like, I like to cuddle. But that's not the case. Anyways, well, that's the song, Stroken by... Yeah. yeah. It's just good that he, when he gave that story, it's good that he found out how often we have sex and whether or not we've done it on a couch. (laughs) Otherwise, how could we possibly have understood that when her stuff is too tight, we could do it there? You know what? When it's it's called... It wouldn't make any sense with all that buildup. It's called accusing the accuser. Oh, when was the last time you had sex on a couch? Right. I didn't say you weren't stroking, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh, really? When was the last time you had sex? Was it last I'm week? I'm not saying you did it. Was it last night? I did. Do- that's not relevant. <laughs> How is that a way to respond to police shining a light on you? <laughs> I, mean, I guess he's stroking. saying, like, you got a fucking problem? I'm stroking. <laughs> like, he's, it's just him being defiant. He's, he's going, like, why don't you take a picture? It'll last longer. I'm fucking stroking. I'm not stealing. I'm right. not fucking. Uh, but you, I'm not you, violating a free speech zone. You very understandably <laughs> took it to a place where if a guy starts talking about I'd be stroking, it sounds like he's masturbating. It turns out no, he's he just he wants anal sex and is not getting it because the police are on his fucking ass. But also, time. like, is he just describing? He's just describing the. When I'm making love, I don't. It's not just making love. Right. I have a special name for it. Oh yeah, that's because not a I knife. do this it. Is a I knife. do it differently. I, 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 I do it better. I, I, what, what is your special name, Dan? Please. I call I'm stroke. I call it stroking. So I don't, I'm, I'm not going to call it making love because you're a fucking plebe, okay? Um, you make love like a fucking barn animal or a or a priest. I'm gonna I'm 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 a fucking hero when I make love. I, right. I'm a trademarkable fucking like branded. Wait, sir, sir. What? I, I'm shining my light on you. I'm stroking. Uh, why is there a <laughs> what, 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 why why is there a compass on your penis right Be, now? Well. Uh, 
I have to ask this as a police officer. And I have to answer okay. as, a, as a stroker. All right. Uh, and uh, and by, by asking why that question, you've already, you've already answered some of my questions that I'll be asking later. Why First, is number compass? one, have you ever stroked? Because you clearly haven't. I've never haven't. seen a compass. I've seen loads yeah. of things in my 15 years as a, hey, as, as hey, a law ask enforcement him, officer. Ask this guy if he's ever done it on a couch. <laughs> hey. Thank you, Emily. I will. <laughs> officer? <laughs> yes. <laughs> have you ever made love? Hey, uh, this will come into play of later. What, what time have you made answer love? Answer my question. What time? Answer mine. I pay your salary. I, what time have you made love? Ask him if he's uh, planning uh, on making uh, love before tonight. Before breakfast? Have I, you made love before breakfast? Of course before breakfast. Okay, well, let me ask you this. All right. Have you done it during the late, late why, show? Why, sir, sir, why is there a compass on your penis? Hit him with it. Because well, I stroke it to the east. <laughs> oh. I stroke it to the west. Okay, so, that, so you, you can tell. And I stroke it to the woman that that I love best. Okay, I'm and not that's asking. what your flashlight is fucking penetrating. I'm not saying penetrating. you're a bad person. I'm saying that this is a residential community where there are strict rules about people making love in their automobiles. Oh, well, do people live here? Yes. Well, do they live, or <laughs> or do I live? Okay, wait now. And am I not more alive than them? Who are you, fucking Camus? I'm a uh, fucking law officer. No, no, never heard of him. Too busy stroking. Well. Dropped out of high school to wait, stroke. Wait, you st- no you st- law against you're stroking, it. You're stroking what? The woman to well, her st- and also her. That's, but that's not how verbs work. You mm, can't stroke it two. Is if you stroke. We didn't it ask is if enough stroke. leading questions. <laughs> I just I need to get I need I to get parity know how, here. What, like, well, how do you put a compass on your dick in the first place? And like, like you, you're so bad at geography that you can't just look at the moon and know when you're fucking to the east or the west. That you have to have a have what a kind compass of pagan on your shit dick? is this? You know, if you're the gonna arrest me, am right I under arrest? Am I under arrest? Yeah, no, no, you you are not. Thank you. You are not being detained. Okay, you are not because being everything you say right now the, can be used against uh, you. The, the, all I right. got your badge number. S- You're out. talking about moon fucking? Step out of the car. Step out of Gladly. the car. Gladly. All right. Step out of the car. Well, hey, you, you might want to step, step to the west a little bit. <laughs> because I was on that stroke are when you, you fucking you, I, interrupted I, I, me with your fascist are fucking... Are you about to be stroking me? Well, no. I'm just saying, like, I, I, I'm sir, mid-stroke and sir, I was... Sir, if you threaten to stroke an officer, uh, but that's uh, that's. I'm not gonna stroke months. you. I stroke the people I love best, and I'm, I'm fucking like I'm. I'm. I am. Who uh, might fucking chop liver? You don't love me at all. Or? I'm cooperating here. I'm cooperating. There's nobody around. There's nobody around. Oh, that's I'm weird. Here. Then why is it against the law for me to stroke? Like, like, like so you caused the I problem. I don't. I don't understand. I don't. Nobody knows why you stroke. Like it sounds like you're jerking off. Did you seek me out because you had stroking questions? Like mine are like like I was minding my own business, you know. Mm -hmm. Like I I, like like maybe I've made love every way you could possibly do it, and I want to fucking find out if there's better ways to do it. Like like I asked you some questions. I already know you've never stroked. Maybe like I don't know what you call it, sir. I throw myself on your mercy. Like, 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 Emily, will you tell him that this is voluntary, consensual, so we can just get in the front seat of the car? Oh, so she has to tell me it's consensual? What? She has to tell me it's consensual. You're going to make her tell me that the stroking was consensual the whole time? No, I'm not going to make her do anything. I'm going to stroke to her while she talks we, to you. Nobody... <laughs> Nobody knows what that means. It sounds fucking, it sounds horrible. It sounds like an awful thing. Stro- yeah, stroking sounds awful, yeah. Yeah, this, this fucking police state. Like, it's, like, it's like we're through the looking okay. glass, man. Stro- right. yeah, stroking's bad, but you All know, right. it's not Vietnam. Don't yeah, Vietnam's me. great. Put your hands on the car. Put All your hands right. on the hood. All right, you know what? Put your hands I'm on not the hood. resisting. Put your hands on the hood. I'm not resisting give arrest. Me a, give me your right hand. My name is Clarence your... Carter. I'm stroking. Give, give, give me your right hand. <laughs> give me your right hand. Put, no, not your right. You're right. Uh, my my east hand. Yes. You're <laughs> now put your west uh, your your west hand back there. Okay. He needs and that. Uh, I I I'm gonna put the cuffs on you, sir. All right. And I'm gonna be stroking. <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Oh! I'm be stroking to the north. I'm be stroking to the south. Stroking to your butt and stroking to your mouth. I'm be stroking. Whoa! Oh yeah. Are you stroking yeah. to the north yeah. and south? Huh? Yeah, yeah. And also, who's going to believe you? No, there's no witnesses? I'm I, right. I, I'm look, I don't, all I needed to know was that you stroked. I there. stroked to the north and the south. Uh, fantastic. You stroked to the east and the west. That's why I was freaked out. I, 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 look, I walk up in a car. I see somebody stroking east and west, and that's confusing to me. Right. 
Uh, I'm a North South uh, Stroker. I get it now. What's your What's your ethnic background? Can I add? Like, are, are you I'm, Norwegian? I'm Portuguese. It makes sense then, yes. because you're. It goes by ley lines. Portuguese. I've heard. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 my family's from the Azores, and we're right on that the... That makes total uh, yeah. sense. Like, I'm not trying to be racist. Okay. I'm African okay. American I, I, myself, look, but what I, I've been I'm, told I, is that I, there's different... It goes by, like, magnetic ley lines. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm going to uncuff you. Like, oh, uh, thank you so I'll, much. I'll just give you a warning on this one. Okay. Uh, keep it to the north and south next time if you're going to be stroking. Well, okay. I mean, I don't see why that... I, I'm not going to... You know what? I'm not going to... What? what? <laughs> I don't... I, I, I don't understand why that has to be a rule just because that's how you stroke. Like, Who strokes I, east and west? Like, 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 like you want to go like up and down. North and south seems like no, a more logical way to stroke. It. Huh. I, I get it now. I get what it's like to be pontificated to about stroking. Can I, can I, can I be honest with you? <laughs> can, can, I, can I give you one secret? Yeah. And I, I, look, can we walk away from the car so your, your Emily doesn't hear us? I've... Uh, I've never actually had sex before breakfast. Wow. Oh. Well, it's like a bingo card. Eventually, everybody fills it. It's not. It's not. A, it's not. It's not about like I. That, like, what I'm trying to impart when I was when I was grilling you about that. Mm -hmm. It wasn't like, oh, do you do it? Like, like, right. I was just saying, like, 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 can we share <laughs> the fact that we've stroked? All right. Anyways. All right. All right. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry. All right, okay, yeah. I, I'll let you go with a warning. Uh, <laughs> Uh, get, get out of here. Uh, drive home safely. And uh, and uh, look, I got to tell you, like, if I ever see you up here again, like, you know, like just you know, keep keep it rolling. Keep you know, move along. Okay. Because I right. have a job to do. You got a job to do. All right, what, what, what 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 do you do? What, what what? How do you make a living? I'm just. I'm uh, I'm a motivational speaker. I... <laughs> really? Yeah, mostly colleges and stuff like. <laughs> Because I suffer from severe depression, and uh, oh well, yeah. let me ask you this. Okay. You, well, I already know the answer to what I was going to ask. Well, mm. don't, don't don't diminish me by thinking that you already know the answers to my. Well, you know when I when I when I when I eat, right. if you like, like when I eat, I don't just eat because you've already had sex. Because I be gluten. <laughs> you eat gluten. Yeah, I be gluten. Uh huh. Yeah, I I, I glute to the east. <laughs> I go to, let me ask you, when you, when you, when you are, eat, are, do you, you ever eat before breakfast? <laughs> Wait, I do, I, I do eat on the couch. Yeah, you might and have actually, like a celiac allergy. The only, the only time I'm ever, I'm, I'm ever happy is eating on the couch. Yeah, and it's probably a bread-related product, a refined yeah. flour, all that stuff. Yeah. I'd be, I be gluten. You'd be gluten. Yeah. Well, then, yeah, is that me too. <laughs> <laughs> all Tell right. them about the time you were gluten on the back seat of the car. Emily! And that cop came up. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.